All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Seopolis with your buddy here, Super Turtle. Guys, today we're going to be continuing on in this mod pack. Going to be working on getting some iron maybe this episode. You know how cool that would be to get some iron? Let's see if we can do it. So, first step to getting the iron is getting this overworld matter, uh, which we need to use our uh, Tinker's Construct smelter to do so. Uh, so, to get this stuff, we need some molten clay, some molten tin, and some organic water. Uh, now, the molten clay and molten tin we have, but the organic water we don't. So, we make that by taking a crucible and putting some plants in it. Well, the cool thing is I went AFK for a heck of a long time, and we filled this guy up. I've even taken logs out here. And then if we look, as you can see, yes, we are running out of storage. There's literally items floating, or there were anyway. There were items floating around outside. Some phantoms are pretty salty out there. Who cares? Okay, so we need to go ahead and make another crucible here real quick. Now we should, we're, we almost have enough clay. There we go, we have enough porcelain clay. Let's go ahead and make up a barrel real quick. All right, so with the storm barrel crafted, there we go. We got our unfired crucible. Guys, it's crazy. Like, what used to take us so long to do now is done in, like, two minutes. It's knucking futz. <laughs> anyway, while that is being crafted up, we're going to go ahead and make a few of the wooden hoppers. We're going to take two of these. Oh, I messed up. There we go. And then we'll just make one. And then we'll be super duper cool. We'll hit R for recipe. And bam, we have a total of 16 of these guys. So now that this is done, we need to put a sp we need we need a spot for it to go. I think it'd be good here. <clears throat> so I just realized we're gonna need some more chesticles. That is quite alright. We have some. Perfect. So one going in, and then chest, and then boom. We're good ski. Okay, and then we're going to put a chest up here as well. So, um, I believe all we need to do... I don't know if we actually need any um, like heat sources below. We do. Okay. Uh, we need a torch under there. Let's... Uh, Let's say uh, try that again. It'll fall in there. We'll die. Um, yep, it's working. We're making organic fluid. Hmm. Okay, so for one, I don't know why we put a chest down there. Anyway, I feel kind of dumb looking back at that. Um, we're going to have to use some type of... I think an item pipe or a fluid pipe for mechanism probably be our best bet as to getting this into our system. Uh, but uh, we really don't need to worry too much about that. And for the time being, we are going to go ahead and extend this guy up a bit. This will allow us to put more items in to be smelted. So we definitely want that. All right, so now we can... We can Smelt three items at a time. Oh, shoot. Now we can't. Okay, so now, yep, we have three inventory slots. If we expand that out to the right or to the left, we'll get even more. Uh, but now we're just going to be worrying about this side. Um, yeah, so this will allow us to smelt down the, the stuff. We need to get rid of the bronze in there. Let me go ahead and do that real quick. Okay, so we got ourselves a little bit of organic water. Uh, so now we're going to grab some tin if we have any left. Do we have any tin? We do have some tin left. Cool. And then we're going to grab some clay. We're going to see if we can make this guy. Uh, but first, we need... We, I, 
We didn't think this. I didn't think this through. You guys are probably yelling at your screen, being like, "You forgot it. You forgot your dinghy. Quit playing with your dinghy." Probably what you're saying, right? No. Okay. Just maybe thinking to myself. All right. We definitely need this guy. So let's go ahead, place you there, place you there. We're gonna swap him out. Actually, we could just add it right here with a faucet. Come here, faucet. Boom, there we go. And now we have the three available slots. Super cool. We're gonna go ahead and grab one of these, put that in there, we lost that bucket. Hello? Are you okay over there, sir? You don't look okay. <laughs> All right, so let's go ahead and how do we do this? <gasps> Oh, that in it. Uh, we need to have that special fluid putter in her, right? Actually, we already have one of those. Okay, so we have the organic fluid in there, tin, and then some clay. We'll let these smelt up, and they should combine. I'm actually really excited. Yes. Molten overworld matter, 20 blocks. Okay, so it's very inexpensive, which is what I'm pretty happy about. Uh, and we're gonna go ahead, we're gonna load up these guys with leaves and just have them keep coming out. Perfect. I wonder what heat lava does in this because if the torch is five, it'd be crazy if like lava was 50. But I feel too stupid to really worry about that. Cool. Overworld matter. So I think we can just come over here and sift it. We got lead and aluminum. Holy crap, guys. It's a party. All right, over here. And we got iron. <gasps> Look at that, guys. Iron. Iron ore piece. Now, we do need four of them. Okay, Don't let's not get too excited like I am. Uh, we do need four. So I'm going to be here for a bit just uh, kind of collecting this up. And why aren't you stacking? Please do so. Please stack. Don't go into my inventory. Why are you doing this? All right, so I got 20 blocks of the overworld uh, matter. I'm going to go ahead and sift it here in a cool time lapse to see how much we get. All right, and for the moment of truth, we have 10. We can make two iron ingots. Oh, my goodness. Look at this free Nautilus shell just chilling here, by the way. All right, so let's go ahead and put this in the blast fur. No. Regular fur. No. How do we turn this in? Um, uh, it's going to make it difficult, didn't it? Uh, we're going to have to use the Tinker's smelter. Oh, well. Oh, well, I don't think that'll mix with anything, will it? We'll find out. Okay, so ooh, we even got some more fluid over here. Let's go ahead and grab some. We're going to put some more in. Boom. And, yes, organic water, molten clay. I miss, I feel dumb. Okay, well, I took that stuff out. Okay, and we have, we have the iron, beautiful... Let's go ahead. I would love to get a gold cast of this. Oh my goodness, you have no idea. All right, there's our first iron ingot. Look at that. So good. Iron ingots for the win. Okay, let's go to our quests. And down here, Flint Sieve. We got this guy. We even got some stuff down here. And yeah, serious advances. Look at all the stuff we've gotten. It's because we're awesome. We even got redstone. I didn't realize we got redstone. That's just made my day. Okay, so there we go. 
Make a solar cooker. That's cool looking. A reflector. Okay. Upgrade base. Letting it. Okay. Uh, gold. How do we... Okay. So first of all, we need to make an iron mesh. All right. The use is here. Is this where we get the gold from? Yes. Okay. So the iron mesh is where we get gold. So to make an iron mesh... We need one block of molten iron poured onto the flint mesh, and then it cooks into that. Okay. All right, so we definitely need to get, ooh, some more. It gave us a lot more than I was anticipating, actually. That's great. Okay, so we just sifted up 58 of those guys. We should have enough. Yep, we sure do. Okay, let's go ahead and get these bad boys in there. And now we did have a casualty. So what I did is I sit, I set up a hopper or a wooden hopper underneath this to put into a chest. Uh, unfortunately, the tin went in there before I realized it, so we did lose the... We, we lost the tin. Uh, the good thing is tin, we just make it with the normal sand. So it's nothing too, like, sad or anything like that. Uh, but now we have six ingots in here. Man, we got enough to, like, we only have to touch these guys. We'll have a few left over. Let's go ahead and grab this guy. We just shift right click it. And then once these are smelted, we will be able to put it here. That, uh, that's not how I thought that would have gone. I was hoping that would lay down. Oh, well. Uh, yep, we have one block here. Maybe it goes in here. Ah, yes, that looks better. <laughs> I was about to say, I was like, that's kind of lame. Okay, and then we still have three ingots left. So we're left with seven iron ingots. Very cool. And that got picked up by our system. Bam, iron. Ooh, iron mesh. Ooh, where am I going? So now, when we sift things... Um, we will be getting gold when we sift the overworld shenanigans. Uh, but we do, in fact, need to get some more materials. Well, we'll put some clay in there for now. I don't have any more tin. Uh, so I'm going to have to do a bunch of sifting of the sand. But the, the cool thing is now we have an iron mesh. So it means that we'll be getting more. And this is becoming a labyrinth on how, like, how to get out of here. Oof. Okay. All right, we have 53 of these guys. We're going to go ahead and use our iron mesh sieve. We're going to get some gold. Here we go. Super duper cool. Okay, so we got a uh, little bit of gold here. I don't want to actually do that just yet. We do have quite a bit of redstone. I did not realize we had all that in redstone in our inventory. Very cool. We are running out of storage space like crazy. Holy heck, Batman. Okay, so... Oh, my goodness. We have gold. We I believe we have enough to make a few casts. Uh, so what we're going to want to do is put those in there... Uh, I'll keep clicking this for a little bit. So this is what I just pretty much do. Uh, I'm like on my phone or something and I just hold down right click and with that hopper down below because as soon as one solidifies the hopper below sucks it out and puts it into the chest. So I either like assign it to a different key and put a weight on it or I just sit here hold it down and do something else. Uh, but super duper easy. Um, let's see. Yep, we do have the gold. Perfect. Now if we go like this and cast it this will give us a reusable cast. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, guys. I'm so excited, holy crap. 
All right, it wants us to make some ingots, uh, but we kind of jumped uh, the, the gun a little bit. We'll go ahead and make another ingot. Look at this. It's still there. Crazy, right? Look, it, the, the cast is still there. We don't have to do this stupid blank sand castle thing. Anymore. Get out of my inventory. You're, you're worth what? It, there's a name tag. Compressed Guardian. That was that kind of freaked me out for a second, I'm not gonna lie. Oh man, it's great. It's so great. <laughs> it's a reusable cast. Oh my gosh. Oh, what is it? We need to make electrum. That's just silver and gold, right? Yeah, one silver to one gold. We do have a bit of silver. We can go ahead and make some of this. Cool. So we're gonna take one guy, put that there. I'm going to be clicking this to get some of those blocks out of there so we can keep, you know, sifting away. And there, the cool thing is that we do have a way to automate this, uh, but we're going to need to set up a separate smeltery just for um, the overgrown matter because otherwise things are going to start mixing. It's not going to be a fun thing. Okay. That there. Yep, we have Electrum. We can go ahead and do that. Alright, how many does it require? Oh, we need to make silver. Well, just throw the rest of it in there. We'll hopefully get it out in time. Nope, didn't get it out in time. Now, oh wait, yes we did. Whew, okay. That shouldn't mix with anything. All right, yep, now we have the silver. Let's go ahead and let that go. Ooh, that was pretty cool looking for a second. Okay, there we go. And we got the Electrum Gold Gear cast. Oh, Electrum Gear, Emerald Gear, Enderium Gear, Gold Gear, Invar, Iron Gear. Uh, how do you make the gear? Okay, we can't do it like that. We shift, we should be able to scroll. Okay, it might actually tell us how to do it. Let's check that out. A wooden gear. Wow, that's easy. Uh, wooden gear, this guy. Okay, yeah, we can do that. Let's go ahead and knock it out. All right, wood gear. Let's place this here like so. Uh, actually, we need to get the silver out of there. We got three of them. Okay, not too difficult. Okay, yes. Silver is out. I'm going to put one gold ingot in. We may need two. And then we're going to use the wood gear to make a cast. Wood is causing my frame rate. Dolphins, leave the items alone. Okay. I believe it's only one ingot. Yep, it's just one ingot. Okay, perfect. And the gold gear is ours. Sweet. All right, we got the silver. Got that silver. Um, we just need to make the lead. Oh my gosh, look at all of the lead. That can't be a healthy amount of lead for us, can it? Don't smelt that. We can recast these, so if we ever make a mistake, we can just go ahead and do that. Um, we are definitely going to take that lead and put it in here. All right, lead, there we go. Ooh, it was like orange for a second. Very cool. All right. We got those guys. Lead is good. And then aluminum. If you're across the pond, that's how you say it. It's pretty cool. I'm not going to lie. I like it. I wonder, does Electrum mix with anything? No, thank goodness. Otherwise, it'd be probably mixing with aluminum. All right. 
And with that, there we go. Those are complete. Whoops. All right, solar cooker. This is rather interesting to me. Um, I don't know why we want to do this, but we're going to do it. We uh, desperately need better storage. Just get out of my inventory, call it good. Okay, so we need to make up some panes. What a pain. All right, we're gonna grab the iron and some wood. All right, solar cooker, we made that. And then reflectors, oof. Use four reflectors? Solar cooker speed. Okay, so we only need one. Good, because I didn't want to use more than one. Okay, so... We can make the slabs. We need the glass. And that should be everything. Oh, we didn't need the glass. Okay, so solar cooker. That worked. Maybe like that. Nope, not like that. Solar cooker. Okay. We are cooking the apples. Now, the more we have of these, the faster this goes, I believe. Very cool. Okay. What else? What are we missing? Oh, upgrade base. Requires four iron... Half of your life. Oh, you know what we should have made? We should have made an iron bucket. Okay, here we go. So we got the cooked apples here. Uh, so these are supposed to... Oh, yeah, these are a much better food source. Okay, so look, we got two and one and a half. We got three. Oh, my gosh, look at all that saturation. So cool. All right, uh, so I'm going to be here for a little while. Uh, going to be getting some more. We need to get some more... Well, I'm gonna be bleh, gonna be getting some more of this overgrown overworld matter so we can get some more iron. Okay, so let's go ahead here and make this upgraded base. Boom. There we go. Filter upgrade. It filters the items, pipes in or out of backpack. Well, this is for backpack. I don't want this. What the? Upgrade base. Upgrade base. What if I throw it and grab it again? No. Um. Oh. It's not unlocked. Probably because we didn't do it earlier. That's not it. Where are you at? Wooden tag. Yes. We didn't make the backpack. Because it required four leather... And we don't die of any. I'm actually going to put one back. Um, yeah, we got to get one of the... Uh, one of the survivalist mesh boys are going again. Actually, we can make that. I'm going to get two going. Because I can. Okay. Oh, that's stupid. Stepped on it. Okay, so this is going to get us leather. This is going to get us leather. Poific. There are so many materials everywhere, guys. Oof. That's probably why I'm lagging so much. You think? All right, but that is going to wrap up this episode today, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you all so much for watching. Guys, we did a lot of stuff today. We got the overgrown stuff. We got iron, guys. Look at our iron. It's beautiful. Look at it. Do you want it? Here you go. Have some iron. It's for you and me, but mostly me. Anyways, guys, I'll see you all in the next episode. Take care. Peace out. Bye-bye.